Okay, this is not gold, but it was made to be fool you that it was gold. This is one of my favorite finds I have, honestly. That's a counterfeit gold coin that I found in Chile. That is a half sovereign. Yeah, there's the soldier stabbing the dragon. What is that, 1900? Something like that. I can't remember exactly what the date is, but absolutely love that. Counterfeit gold coin. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. All right, let's get on to the video. All right, once again, my battery's just about to die, but I think I got something cool. That's uh, not gold. I thought it might have been. Oh, it might be. <laughs> I think it is. I think it's 10 carat. Oh, that's cool. Or maybe it's just bronze or I don't know. It's not very corroded. It was down there a bit, too. That be gold. Oh, look, nailed it. I'll get back to you here in just a second. Boy, that sure looks like old gold. But oh, I think I see a mark. I just said no. This thing is awesome. I just did see a maker's mark. There it is. You can barely see it. I'll get a better picture of it later. I don't know if that's gold, but it is super cool. So stoked with that. It is a little heavy, but not as heavy as I would think. <laughs> Alright, see you over next. Unbelievable. It looks like I just hit gold again. Dig that foil, folks. Wow, look at that thing. Awesome. Oh, gotta have to dig back. doesn't want to come out there it is <laughs> unbelievable the head is most definitely gold look at that cool little ring oh my goodness Are you kidding me you know how many times I've walked over this foil signal awesome I'll show you here in a second all cleaned up there's no doubt that's gold. Excellent. See you on the next. Alright, this find could be cool. It looks like a copper coin, but it's got a reeded edge. I can hear you all screaming at me. Stop rubbing that coin. Yeah, well, I thought it was a token when I dug it up. Had never seen this variety of gold coins before. And uh took me a while to believe that I actually did dig up the Holy Grail. $5 gold piece. 
probably never happen again. But if it does, I'll know what it is next time. <laughs> All right, back to the video. Huh. What is that? Feels like copper. Nineteen eleven. Five dollars, is this? No, it's not. It's got to be fake. It's heavy, but it can't be a gold coin. Could that be a... What? Are you kidding me? Now I'm starting to freak out a bit. It doesn't look like gold, it looks like copper. Oh my god. I think I just found a $5 gold piece. Oh my god. <clears throat> Alright, now. Let's see if I can get to focus on it. I just found a gold coin. I think I just found a gold tooth. So it's ringing up exactly in the gold range. Yikes, huh? Yeah, and it's heavy. Crazy. Yeah, it's hitting a 56, which is right in the gold range, and foil and everything else. Small rubbish. Crazy. I don't know. I'll clean it up when I get home and show you again. That's what it looks like to me. Alright, see you in the next. Just hit gold again. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me. Unbelievable. Alright then. See you on the next. It's going to be a gold ring. <laughs> That's absolutely fantastic. Alright then, dig those foil signals. This one was on the low end of what I normally dig, but glad I did. You know what? Gotta dig those foil signals. You see that? I just push the leaves aside. I think that is a gold ring. It's gotta be. Wow. Whoop. Yeah, I don't see any marks in it. Oh, no, there's a mark. I'm sorry, I'm shaking a little. Let me look. I think it says 10K. <laughs> oh, dude. Unbelievable. Up on this hillside I shouldn't be on. And then look at what I got. Awesome. See you on the next.
Look at that. 14K. <laughs> Got me a 14 karat gold ring. How awesome is that? Oh man, you gotta dig those pull tab singles. You're not gonna find the gold unless you do. Alright then, I'll show you a better picture of it here in a second. Awesome. See you in the next. I'm not quite sure uh, what this is. Is it a ring? It is a ring. And there's two of them. Look at that. Cause they, I don't think they're gold. They are kind of heavy. <laughs> Unbelievable. Alright, well I'm going to clean these out and I'll get back to you in a second if I see any markings. I don't see anything yet. Crazy. Yeah, there's a mark in there. Yep, there's a mark in there. 750, I believe that. Stainless. Oh well, still, <laughs> that's cool. All right then, I'm just rescan the hole, and there is the third one. That one looks like gold, but I'm guessing that's another stainless ring. They sure are ringing up clean from stainless, though. I must say, usually stainless. Well, no, this isn't the day use. This is the equinox. I don't actually know how. Oh no, this one says 10K. I don't know if you can see it. Or does it say 5K? I don't know what it says in there. <laughs> right on. That one is very heavy. Awesome. First goal of the Equinox. Okay, so we've got those three gold rings, but I'll show you what I dug to find them. There you go. Gotta dig those pull tabs. Kinds of pull tabs. I'm not sure what that. Oh, that's an old fuse. Yep, shotgun shells. All these ring up in the gold range. Aluminum caps. Yep. Gotta dig those pull tabs. All right, so here's the gold that I found that did not show in the video, either because I found it before I started making videos, or I just didn't put it in this one. But these are three items I found in Chile. Those are gold rings, probably eight or nine carat. A little religious pendant. Yeah, I can't remember what it said. Marta Para? Yeah, I'm not sure, but it's Christmas, 1965. So who knows when that was lost? This is really cool. That's a uh, pocket watch keeper that hooked onto your lapel. This is my very first gold ring I ever found. And it's absolutely gorgeous. And it's it's an old one. That's a green emerald in there. Who knows what the other stone was. But that's one of my favorite gold finds I've found so far. There's a little 14K gold band. There's 
another 14k gold band. Oh, here's a 14k full of diamonds. Yeah, that's a nice little ring. There's another 14k, a big fat wedding band I found in the Virgin Islands. Here's one that I found before I started videoing. That's 10k white gold with 18 diamonds. What is it? One, two carat, something like that worth of diamonds. I don't know. See, there's three there, three on the beam, and then three on the side, little tiny ones. So that's 18, 19, 20, oh, 21 diamonds. <laughs> yeah, that one's uh, for sale on eBay about somewhere between $800 and $1,000. So here's another gold, part of a gold ring I found on the beach. 10K white gold locket. Not just gold, but it's super thin. And there's no stamps on it. I'm pretty sure that's gold. And gold nugget found on the beach here and then this tiger's eye with a gold band around it probably about 8k as well all right well just wanted to show you that so